Hello everyone, and welcome to an important update, or well, for the iOS systems anyway. iOS 7 is finally released. It actually came out uh, a day or so ago, but recording this on a Friday, because it's going to take some time, so a lot of editing over the weekend. I'll probably edit it tomorrow. But anyway, we have an update for the iPad. So we will update it. You need 2.4 gigabytes of space on it. You need it backed up and everything. You need it um, fully charged. It's at 91%, but it's fine. I actually deleted all my music off of this to actually do this. It comes with a lot of different features and such. So yeah, let's agree to it. So for update is yeah, okay. Continue. It is a hun. It's a six hundred and um, six hundred and something megabytes. So this is gonna take a long time. But yeah, I'll keep an eye on it. Uh, I'll just cut the um the half an hour. It's gonna take in it. Because like, this is a wireless connection, and this is my new router it's doing it off of. Well, not new, but fairly new. Um, so yeah, I'll get back to you in a bit when it's almost complete. Okay, so i just gone over half phase, just preparing the update. Now, uh, so I might as well explain a few features that I know in the um, update. There's going to be integ better integrated Facebook and Twitter, which I will be doing a review of them two apps separately because I hear that they're very good. We're going to get new icons, so like ironed out icons, I think, because that's what they look like to me. They look like really ironed out kind of things. I mean, they, they, they actually look quite cool because I like... Um, things like that. So they keep it up with the times. Um, obviously bug fixes. No idea if they're going to do something with Skype, but that's its own app because that's not really in integrated. Um, I think with the iPhone 5s, which it comes automatically with iOS 7, um, the um, Siri in it becomes better. But like I said, I don't really know much about it yet. I'm going to have to fiddle around with it myself because I decided not to watch any um, reviews and looks on it um, this time because I want to leave it as a surprise for when I fiddle around, fiddle around with it later. Um, so yeah. Anyway, I'll leave it for now. I'll get back to you later. Okay, uh, it's finished processing it, now it's verifying it, it's popped up my message saying it's going to be in two parts, I believe I only got notice of it um, a few, in the last few seconds and just, just this. So after it starts verifying it, it will go into a um, blank screen and a little bar will pop up in the middle. Uh, hopefully we'll get something different in a... Apple icon where's my window in you for reflection yeah. and hopefully we'll get something different than the old Apple icon but it's a standard really I mean you don't really expect it to be different because it's like it's day you know what up with it Yeah, Apple icon. Let's turn the fan off because it's loud. Oh, it is a different icon this time. Alright, let's zoom in a bit. Let that fill up. Um, it's dimmed the screen so it will conserve power. Um, which is a good idea now it's just installing the um, update so it's probably take a bit of time but it's catching up pretty quickly and yeah that is a different installation screen I believe yeah 
Um, so yeah, I'll leave it for a bit, and I'll be back later. Okay, um, so it's just finishing off the insulation here. Let me turn that off. So as soon as that will be done, it'll go into the it'll go into the next phase. As soon as this lot is done, hopefully any second now because got nothing to go. But yeah, I think this is the last bit. It probably needs to make a quick install afterwards because Apple loves to verify things apparently. Um, so yeah, a few other features that I just found out just now it's got an iTunes radio on Apple radio on it and it says it's got uh, just over a hundred new features on on this so yeah and it's like nearly half past 11 at night so this update has been going on for nearly two hours now. <laughs> like I said, uh, fully charged, or pl keep it plugged in if you can, I just charge this up as best as I can, so it would be good, um, keep it backed up at all times, but I'm on I iCloud I think with this, so yeah, um, it's just to set itself as the Apple icon again, bit bright, <laughs> I just yeah. It's probably doing there we are. And uh, another bar's just popped up so let me zoom in a little bit. Uh and I think this is just installing what's left of the um software. Um it's actually holding up pretty well because if I did this uh, last time with the iOS 6 I still had my old old router that keeps on packing up all the time so it wouldn't do it any good because like, the internet would cut out while I'm doing this and I don't think that's a good idea to have your internet cut out while updating an iOS device because it might end up damaging it in some way but I believe next time you turn it on it'll say would you really like to restore and try again so yeah, because I believe you can actually try again with updating this, but this one has gone through and the thing is almost done. Right, I'm almost certain it is almost done, so we should be seeing the screen really quickly. Yep, we got icons. Oh, hello. Hola. Yep, we are getting all the phases. This is the um, new, the new screen. It's saying hello in all different languages. Um, this is interesting. I ain't, I ain't seen this before. Oh, done something. What did it do? Oh yeah, slide to set up. There you go. Update complete. iPad has been updated successfully. There's just a few more steps to follow. Continue. Location services enable. Oh, password. Okay. Continue. Create a password oh, on the iPad. Okay. There we are. Welcome to iPad. Get started and yee, look at all the nice little icons. Uh, spotlight has moved. So okay, dismiss. We're not interested. But yeah, that is all the icons, all the nice little icons that are going to be on the iPad. Look how nice they look. I mean, they look awesome. Everything like that looks great. That does. Um, take a, I'll take a snapshot and stick at the end of the video. 
But yeah, that was the um to zoom out a bit here. That was that was the install of iOS 7 on the iPad 2. Um, but be warned, I I believe that there be, to be a bug on the iPhone 4s if you update it. So for the sake of the phone, I'm not I'm not going to update our 4s's uh, because I usually do and I usually do a video, but I'd rather wait until the bug fix gets did and all that stuff. But yeah, I'll be more focusing on focusing on this, and hopefully we're going to get a iPhone 5s or a 5c soon. So I'll be doing a review on that as well. But anyway, um, that was it for the um, install. Hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys next time. So until then, see you guys.